Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do a little midweek video. This never happens. <laughs> um, I had a blog post scheduled for this Style Pro and I just wanted to explain it a bit more. Um, I think it's a really great product but I think you have to sort of use it right to get what you want out of it. So, hence this video. So I'm going to let you know what I think but first let's see it in action. So, as you will have seen by now, the Star Pro comes in a little bubble like this. Um, basically, you can put the fluid that it comes with in there, so that is the cleanser, or you can put hot water and soap in there and clean your brushes. So for foundation, they recommend the cleanser, and then for powders, they recommend just soap and water. So this is the main bit that holds all the water. Then you have two sections. So you obviously have the silicone holders which hold your brushes. So there's quite a few of those ranging from very, very small to very, very large. So you can get a range of brushes in this. The only thing that I haven't figured out yet is whether you can clean a beauty blender with it. I assume not because of the logistics of it. But yeah, if you are a big beauty blender fan, then maybe this isn't for you. You obviously use less brushes. But if you're a big brush fan, then this thing is incredible. So then the final part is the actual uh, bit itself. So you attach the silicone bits to here and they will spin round with your brush in it. So you dip your brush in the solution, whether that be just soap and water or the actual solution that it comes with, and then you can turn it on and whiz it around and it comes out so, so clean. So I did the cleanser with one of my brushes and it was literally sparkling clean. And then I tried it again with a brush that I use for my uh, bronzers. So all powder based with just the soap and water. So this is one that I use for just soap and water. As you can see, it's still quite stained, but it's clean um, and it's dry, which is great but I will have to clean this again. So I would recommend using just the cleanser. I like my brushes to be mega, mega clean. If I'm gonna clean them, they're gonna be sparkling. So yeah, I think the cleanser probably is the one for me moving forward. I probably will not use just soap and water. I do however usually use soap and water for when I clean my brushes anyway. So it's nothing against the whole soap and water thing. I think with this device, it just doesn't, obviously just doesn't work. I also tried um, a bit of a smaller one, almost like a pencil brush, and the same thing happened. There was still quite a bit of excess left on there. But overall, I really liked it. I love the fact that it's super easy to use. It does an amazing job. So yeah, I'm one of those people that hates sitting over the sink, cleaning brush after brush after brush, because I leave them to collect up. I just do. I will never get out of that habit. <laughs> so yeah. I hate doing it, so this will make my life so much easier. I guess in terms of storage and stuff, it is, uh, there's not that much of it, but it is still another thing to store. So yeah, I actually, I'm not gonna keep the box. I'm just gonna put it in a bag altogether so I don't lose any of the bits, and then that's it. I think it will make it so much easier to store, um, and yeah, this will essentially be something that comes out probably once a week, so I don't really want it to be like, almost displayed somewhere um, it will just be a functional thing so that is it for this video I hope you liked it I hope it helped a little bit I've got links on my blog to both the actual style pro and the cleanser so if you need a top up but I believe you can get it all from boots anyway so there you go but um yeah definitely check out that blog post if you think they're is anything I've missed out I've probably covered it there so yeah I hope you like this video if you did give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one bye